started with uh, Chris Brown. So Chris Brown dropped his album last Friday. Uh, I believe it was Breezy. I believe that was the name of it. If I'm not mistaken, give me one second. Y'all know I'm bullshit up. Pre, I didn't. I didn't do my fucking pre, my uh, my mic pre check before the show. I didn't pull shit up before the show. I'm, I'm off. But we gonna do. What, we gonna make it do what it do. Yep. Uh, Chris Brown dropped his album Breezy last Friday. It's a twenty. 24 track album which is if you uh if you familiar with chris brown his last couple albums that's light that's real light work because that nigga put out fucking 40 song albums in a goddamn heartbeat but um it's uh it's pretty good i'm i'm gonna keep it a bug with you i'm not the biggest uh chris brown fan um when he drops i i i check out a few of the songs because like i said it's usually like 40 40 45 songs on this bitch so you know i usually go through and skim through it um i mean overall chris brown don't really put out no bad music but it's just kind of like i don't know bro i don't and i hate to use the argument that all his shit starts to sound alike after a little while but i mean but um it's, it's not really that it it starts to sound alike it just my nigga, I don't know. It, it just be a lot of songs, bro. It's kind of like, my nigga, all right, they they cool. They good songs, my nigga. But it's like, fam, I'm not, I don't know. It don't really hold my attention like that. I'm going to be honest with you. But like I said, the nigga don't make bad music. Maybe I'm just the wrong fan or the wrong person to, that he's, I, I, I'm not the target audience, obviously. Um, But I did like it. Um, it's an album that if if a song from the album comes on it, uh, while I got my shit on shuffle, I'm not gonna skip it. Um, it was a couple, it was a couple standouts on it that I really like. Uh, the Sex Memories with LMA, um, the one with uh, I think Wayne and yeah, Wayne and Blue, that shit was pretty good. Um, Blue is if y'all not familiar with which i'm sure some of y'all are but blue formerly known as uh young blue he dropped the young off his name uh that nigga don't miss fam and actually i've been the last what four days i've listened to that nigga's album probably probably three times in the last four or five days bro but um that's that's just uh going off on a tangent but uh, let me see. It was also the song with uh Blast, show it, show it with Blast, featuring Blast, and then um, Bad in a Beach featuring Tory Lanez. That shit was pretty good. Uh, like I said, overall, I'm not the biggest Chris Brown fan, but I do like the project. I ain't gonna hold you. I do like the project. It's a good project. It's a solid project. Like I said, Chris Brown, in my opinion, even though I'm not that big of a fan, he don't make bad music. So it's like. It's kind of like you get what you expected with Chris Brown. Uh, it's going to be a lot of songs. All of them going to sound good to, you know what I'm saying, a certain extent. Like, nothing is, I mean, I just, I can't say nothing is trash. Nothing is trash about the album. It's just, like I said, I'm not the biggest fan, so I can't really say it's, I'm not going to sit there and say it's fucking great because just because it's Chris Brown. Like, don't get me wrong, Chris Brown is definitely a, a, a fucking legend, but like I said, I'm just not the, I'm just not the, uh, the biggest Chris Brown fan, bro. Like, the nigga make good music, but I mean, kind of is what it is, I guess. Uh, so let me see. 